Welcome back to Compelled Cooperation, taking on Doom, the one that started it all, at least in the frame of reference of Chex Quest. The Chex Quest run went over fairly well, so I decided, you know what, I'm going to play through Doom, because I really like Doom. We're going to go through, and this is the ultimate Doom, so it has four episodes. We're going to do Knee Deep in the Dead to start off with, and Ultra Violence. Extreme Ooze, if we're talking in Chex Quest terms. And we're going to see some of the basic enemies here. These are shotgun guys, a.k.a. former sergeants. And there's a couple over here. You can tell I've played some of these levels before. I've played through all of Doom and Doom 2, but not through all of the master levels for Doom 2 or Final Doom, which is some more stuff. I'm going to pick up some armor. All of it's available on Steam if you buy the ID Complete Pack, or sorry, ID Complete Pack. I'm used to saying ID just from the cheat codes in these games are all prefixed with ID. So if you want to change the level, it's ID CLEV, and then the episode and level number, this being 1 1, E1 M1, that is. And this is a switch that was added in the Ultimate Doom make this level a bit better for a deathmatch online. And if I go just far enough, you can see it actually opens up the area over there. This is so people could have a little more mobility in deathmatch and hop out and grab various different things. So there's some armor out there that's a different color. I'll go and grab that in a second. Some of these guys are sneaking up on me here. I'm going to go outside and grab this. You'll notice that my view isn't moving up and down. And that's because in the original Doom and Doom 2, in the original Doom engine, it's actually 2D and only pseudo 3D. It's rendered as 3D, but the levels are all designed as 2D. And so because of that, there is no looking up and down. It's all automatically aiming up and down which has its benefits and drawbacks. When I played through Chex Quest, I turned on the actual mouse look for everything, but this time around I'm just using mouse look as you would in the original Doom. I'm gonna go back and run in here. It's a secret. There's a lot more secrets in Doom than there were in Chex Quest. And I do not know them all, and if you want someone to do a 100% run, you can find a lot of ones on YouTube that are available. If you want to get 100% secrets, 100% enemies, 100% items picked up. But that is not me. I'll do the best I can, but I do not know everything. And I got apparently everything this time around. This is E1M1 Hangar. As you can see, we are gradually moving on to the next area. Some of these early levels will be a little bit shorter than the other ones, and some of the later levels will be a lot longer, so don't worry, things will average out. But we'll see you in the next episode.